Hey guys, JC here with another episode of Fahrenheit. In the last episode, um, the police came to Lucas's apartment, and uh, thankfully they didn't find any incriminating uh, evidence. So now I'm dressed and ready to go to work. And here we go. Okay, so I'm going to go to Carla Valenti now. She's at the police station. I've got this really bad habit for a cop. Once I start working on a case, I can't think about anything else. I'm exhausted. I haven't gotten a wink of sleep all night. Something's bothering me about this murder, but I just can't seem to put my finger on what it is. Yeah, it's because it was committed by a guy that was possessed, you know, that's not normal. Okay, let me just look around a bit. This is the police station. Yeah. Looks a bit like the police station in Raccoon City. Weird. Okay, so... Someone over there? Who are you? Oh. Not paying attention to me. So. Hi, Carla. How are you doing today? Hi, Doug. Not too bad. Is Tyler here yet? No, not I know of. So, ready for that big retirement? Eh, <laughs> working on it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this guy now. Well, doesn't she have a gun? That's weird. Okay, let me see. Anything I might have missed? What is this? Something. There's something here. Uh, a banoff. That's interesting. And some books. Okay. Now I know there are bonuses hidden. What? A door? The door leading to the basement. I have no business down there right now. Okay. Tyler is still not here. I'd better try to give him a ring. And now she's stressed. Um, can I use your phone? No, I'm gonna go up, maybe I have an office. Okay, so, interesting. What is that? Ah, Carla Valenti, good. So, that's my office. Hey, Carla! Can you tell your partner to pay me back that hundred bucks he owes me? I've been waiting six months for it now. Can't Shut up. Help you there, Jeffrey. Talk to him about it. He's been avoiding me like the plague. Plus, you know, you're the only one he listens to. Catch you later, Jeffrey. What an annoying guy. Hi, Carla. Hi, Garrett. So, Oh, wait, Carla. I got some results back on the tests we did for that restaurant murder. Great. As soon as Tyler gets here, we'll come and see you. Okay, I'll be at my desk all morning. Okay. So... What can I do here? A ball? Tyler hates it when anyone touches his stuff. Okay. Then I'm not going to touch his stuff. Just gonna sit here. Okay, so I was going to call him.
pick up the phone, damn it. Hmm. He's a player. Yeah. Know what time it is? Oh, shit. Get a move on. The waitress is coming this morning to flesh out the composite on the killer. I'm on my way. Yeah, he's on his way. Okay, so... What is this? Okay. And something in my drawer. Oh, good. Bonus. Awesome bonus. Okay, so let's use the computer. What do we have? Mail. Mail. First mail. Volume. Oh. Spam. Interesting. Volume for less dot com. Okay. Hi. From Tommy. Um, lots of kisses, Tommy. Maybe her boyfriend? And no title. It's all happened before. Kirsten. What's that supposed to mean? She's getting more anxious. No reason to get anxious. Who's this Kirsten? Web. Um, what is this? The mayor is embarrassed, embarrassed by a rising crime. Three months to the elections. Okay. And no, I want to see the other snow. Yeah, this is the same snow and Pakistan the ultimatum ends today. Yeah. Database. New York police database. No entry. So Kirsten. Search. Classified file. So, it's a name associated with a case. Too bad. I would have liked to find out more. You have only one person named Kirsten in your database? That's weird. Okay. So... Next word. No. Just Kirsten. Okay, so... I'm going to turn off the computer. Oh no, I just used it again. Okay, I'm going to stand up. And what should I do now? You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna play with this ball. Tyler still hasn't gotten rid of this basketball. Funny, I thought I'd been pretty clear. Oh. I can switch. <laughs> Isn't it a bit cold to be sleeping like that? Come on, get up, man. Let's stay a little longer. Mm, sorry, babe, but I really gotta go. Oh, I'll make some coffee. Okay, I'll grab a shower, get dressed, and and I'm out of here. Come on, man. She's, she's telling you to stay a little longer. Man. I love watching her when she's sleeping. I've known her for two years now. She still rocks my world the way she did the first time I ever saw her. Yeah, she's nice. I thought you were in a hurry. Hey, I always got two minutes for you, babe. Only two minutes?
<laughs> and she's still waiting. Okay, what happens if I go back to... Oh yeah, they're having some quality time. Uh, can I move the camera? No. Uh, I don't think I can do anything. <laughs> Hey, the lava lamp is not moving. Yeah, I noticed that, I know. This is starting to look like an adult movie. But, no. I don't think there's anything else I can do here. So... Uh, yeah, same sequence. Going back to Carla now. Okay, so... What shall we do? Um, can I do anything in Tyler's desk? Nope. Anything here? No. Okay, might as well go outside. Nine guy. Hi, Frank. Hey, Carla. Sleep well? Sleep's a waste of time. I'll have plenty of time to sleep when I'm dead. That's our Carla. Yeah. What about here? Captain Jones hasn't come in yet. I'll catch him later. Nobody here. No. Nope. Hello, Inspector. What's up? Nobody here. Here. Nobody <clears throat> here. What about this one? Hi, Carla. How are you? Nobody here. He said hello to you. You didn't even pay him attention. Okay, what? Okay, this door opens. Tyler is still not here. I'd better try to give him a ring. Okay, so I have to go back. The trigger element is definitely Tyler coming in, but since, you know, I wanted some loving uh, he's late. So? Nobody this, here. Oh, sorry. Got disoriented. So, let's call him again. Carter, I'm on my way. Uh, yeah, I know. No, I, no, I, I just had a little problem, so I'll... <laughs> yeah, okay, okay, I'm right there. <laughs> okay, now I can switch. Whew, girl. Okay, this time I really am out of here. Just check something real quick. A statuette of socks. One of the characters in my favorite video game. Socks? Okay. So, I cannot do anything with her? No? Too bad. Okay. Um. Hey! You're a good-looking guy, you know that? 
<laughs> yeah. It's broad daylight outside. I think I'm a little early. Uh, no. You're not a little early. Um. Bathroom. Yeah, looking good, man. Okay, can I... Oh! Bonus. You see, it pays off to explore. Yeah. I needed to do that. And... You're not gonna wash your hands. Okay, jump in the shower. Real quick, man. Real quick. No long showers for you. What is going on? Is she thinking of joining me? Oh no. She's just going to make some coffee or something? Okay, so clothes, clothes, I saw, here we go, get dressed. Huh? There's a note over there. Oh, uh, uh, this is the bathroom. Wrong door. Okay, so this way. Uh oh, Sam looks like she's sulking. And I know what's bothering her. What the the thing that I have to go see Carla? Okay. Make some coffee, perhaps? Go back to bed, Sam. You're gonna catch a death of cold like that. I'm not cold. Oh, crap. Oh, look, Sam, please don't start. I got no intention of dying today. I'm sick of living in fear like this. Every morning I'm, I'm terrified that something's gonna happen to you. Uh, understand tender. I know how you feel, Sam. You just need some time, that's all. I don't like to see you like this. You know that, baby. Well, what if you quit? We could move to Florida and take over my parents' store. We'd have a normal life. We could have a baby. Uh, conciliatory. I'm not ready for a normal life yet, Sam. Right now, I belong here. You need to try to accept me for what I am and what I choose to do. Okay. That would definitely not have worked with a real woman, but... <laughs> okay, can I get a kiss goodbye? No? Okay. So... Mm, interesting. Okay, I'm gonna get this. And... Yeah, don't look at me like that. Okay. And now I'm going to leave. Aren't you going to kiss me? Yeah, of course. I was trying, but it was not giving me the option. I love you, Tyler. Okay. Yeah, I know, I know, I'm late. Hi, Tyler. Oh, uh, Carl is looking for you. Yeah, I know. So, you ready for retirement, man? Yeah, <laughs> I'm working on it. Okay. Yeah, some funky music, man. Good. Yeah. Nice. Hey, 
Hey, Tyler, what do you know? Just the guy I was looking for. Oh, no. Oh, shit. You remember that hundred bucks I loaned you about six months ago? I'd really like for you to get that back to me as soon as possible. Like maybe now, for example? Uh, friendship. Jeffrey, don't tell me you're prepared to ruin a beautiful friendship for a hundred lousy dollars. This may surprise you, but yes. So give up the cash before I start to get really angry. Proposition. Yo, let me make you a deal. I'll play you a game of b-ball for your hundred bucks. If you win, I'll give you two hundred bucks right then. But if you lose, we cool. You'll give me two hundred bucks if I win. You got my word, man. All right, you're on. But don't even think about not paying me if you lose, because that... Don't worry, Jeffrey. I'll come by and see you when I get five minutes. Yeah. So, later on, we're going to do that. Okay, guys, before facing Carla, she's going to be really angry. Uh, I think I'm going to leave this episode here. That's it for now. See you next time. Destruction and creation.